Good morning. It is 7.20 and Andy and I are on our way to Montreal. Montreal. I'm here with Garnier because tomorrow I'm going to be shooting some videos with them to promote their new Skin Active line, which they may or may not have left some products in the hotel room for me. Should we do a little haul? I think so. We got the Soothing Facial Mist with Rose Water, the Soothing Cleansing Milk also with Rose Water, the Soothing Balm, which I actually just used because my skin desperately needed some hydration after that flight. Although I'm thinking that I kind of want to stay in and do a sheet mask now. <laughs> we have the Moisture Balm Sheet Mask. This one is with pomegranate extract and hyaluronic acid. And the pink one has chamomile and hyaluronic acid. I will definitely be using one of these tomorrow morning before the shoot because I want to make sure my skin looks good. Especially because I'm going to be meeting with a naturopath. We're going to be talking about my skin so I want to make sure it's on point. Um, I also brought somebody with me. We love this city, so after the shoot is all said and done, we do plan on exploring. Uh -huh. Maybe a little poutine? Definitely poutine. Maybe some coffee? Are you kidding me right now? Remember that shop we went to last time? Oh, the one that's in the old bank. Uh -huh. We'll have to check that out for sure. Good morning, it's shoot day. So you guys saw I started the morning off with that sheet mask. I tried out the Moisture Balm Super Hydrating Mask with chamomile and hyaluronic acid. So my skin is ready for the day. I'm gonna use a little bit of that mist though to prep. Ooh, very nice. And luckily I don't have to do too much makeup because there's a hair and makeup team on set. So I'm just gonna quickly do a little bit of brow, maybe a quick base to make myself look presentable. And then it is time to go. Day three in Montreal. Yesterday was great. I had so much fun filming those videos with Garnier. And this morning while I get ready, I thought that I would share the products that I took home yesterday and what I learned on set. So I already showed you this product the other night when we got to the hotel room, but it's the Soothing Facial Mist with rose water and we talked a lot about this on set yesterday because they said it's good for anybody that wears a lot of makeup like myself because you can use it before or after makeup and it's really just meant to refresh your skin and let me tell you i sprayed this like a hundred times yesterday and my makeup still looked good by the end of the day and my skin felt good it smells so good and by the way there are three different lines to choose from depending on your skin type they sent me home with the products meant for oily to combination skin and all these products have green tea extract in them and another cool thing I forgot to mention is these products are made with 96% naturally derived ingredients so when you look at the label on the back it's cool to see that you can actually understand all the ingredients listed and it's just nice to know that you're using something that is good for your skin. I used the cleanser last night to take off all my makeup, which it did really nicely. But this morning, after using it, I noticed it gave me like a really shiny face. Look how squeaky clean my skin looks. Mm -hmm. And then I used a toner afterwards and it completely took away all that shine. And these are mattifying products, so it was cool to see that that actually worked. And there is a moisturizer for this line as well. It's actually a mattifying gel and it's a three-in-one product. You can use it for the day, night, or as a mask. It says to leave it on for 10 minutes if you're using it as a mask. But looks like this. And I haven't actually used the moisturizer yet, so I'm going to do it with you guys. I like that it's a gel because those are usually the moisturizers that I tend to wear better for my oily skin. 
feels light, not super thick on the skin. Do a little bit on the neck. Actually, you're supposed to rub up on the neck. Everyone always says that, and I always, like, for some reason, want to, like, take it down. That's nice. And finally, for this line, there is a scrub. It's called the Deep Pore Exfoliating Scrub, and this is exactly what I'm after right now because I have been noticing so many pores on my skin. I said this a few videos back, but in my T-zone especially, I don't know what it is. Maybe just because of the fact that I wear a lot of makeup or maybe I'm not taking my makeup off well enough or, you know, age. But I have so many more pores, so I'm trying to use products to help eliminate them. And I use this, and what I liked about it is my skin felt good afterwards, but it didn't feel raw. There's a lot of scrubs that after you use them, your skin just feels so sore afterwards and I didn't feel that with this. It's gritty but not too gritty if you know what I mean. And that's the line. Let me know what you guys thought of the products and if you'll be picking any of them up in the comments down below. I really hope you guys liked watching this video. It was cool doing something a little bit different. Like first of all coming to Montreal filming with a brand but also filming in a different space that is not my own. And by the way, I don't know if you guys saw my ring light. Yes, I did bring that from home, but I think it's time to put on a little bit of makeup, get ready for the day. I'm looking a little bit puffy. It could be due to the full-size pizza I ate all to myself last night. <laughs> you guys want to see what I'm talking about, be sure to check out our Montreal vlog. Andy and I have been vlogging while we're out here, so check out Life with Trina, my vlog channel. Click this box, it'll take you over there. I hope you guys like that video too. We're having such a blast. And until next time, I will see you all real soon.